Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we are going to explore Amazon Inspector, a powerful AWS security service that automatically scans EC2 instance uh, for the vulnerabilities and exposures along we can have the Lambda and all. So I will walk you through with the EC2 instance example, a demo, and I can I will show you the results that are being the basically the findings that are being done by the AWS Amazon Inspector. So before we start, like you need to go to the AWS console and uh, activate that for 15 day trial. So you will be getting something like this. So once you go there, you can get started for a 15 day trial for the inspector. So before we start, inspector is just an automated security assessment service. It scans EC2 instance, container images, Lambda function, to find the various vulnerabilities, any missing patches, or any kind of risky software that are being there in the EC2 instance. It also helps us to like identify the potential security issues before attackers do. So it's everything is automatic and continuous. So basically, the working is something like this. So Amazon Inspector. It continually evaluates your resources for software vulnerabilities and unintended network exposure. So we can enable it and make it sure you add it. Uh, we can use the AWS organization for multi account management, but once you go to this, uh, your account, when you activate, you need to enter the which account ID you want to activate it. You can have for multiple accounts also. So you can utilize that. I have already activated in my account, so I won't be able to show, but once if you haven't enabled, it will give you a 15 day trial. So once you click activate, I will show you the account management and all. So you can see it will automatically workload discovery, continuous scanning. So after those all discover and scan, so it will be contextualize your findings and then we can take action to this. APN partners, ECR, even bridge and security hub and all. So this is a basic working. So I will do one thing. Let's go to the EC2 and I will explain you how we can have a small demo for this. Mm -hmm. This uh, this inspector scanning takes a little bit uh, time. So what I have done, uh, I have already completed the whole demo, but I will just explain you the, all the steps. So basically what I have done over here, first I have launched an instance. So you can launch an Amazon EC2 instance. So you can just launch over here and you can just use Amazon Linux. That's it. So the rest of the things like if you want if you want to check for vulnerability ports and all you can enable some random ports and all you can allow the http traffic and all from all ips so you can see whether it is being uh, marked as a vulnerable and all so all those things you can check it over here so once your once your instance is running then you go back to your inspector over here and you can see I'm already running a trial. So if you go to the, this is a dashboard, it's showing one instance, it has been scanned 100% over here, one out of one. So if you see over here, we have EC2 scan settings by default, it will be a hybrid. So we'll, basically the inspector will use agent-based scanning for all the eligible instance managed by SSM. So, and it will be, Agentless using the EBS snapshots for eligible instance. So you can see over here, we have this hybrid approach. So agent base, it is only eligible for EC2 instance that are SSM managed will be actively scanned. So we are using this hybrid approach. Just click save, don't change that one. Now, if you go to the account settings over here, you can see this is how it is being activated. So once you click on a 15 day trial or when you're starting for the first time, it will ask you the account number. So you sell, enter your account number for which you want to activate and that's it. So it should show like this to you. So once it has been activated, it will take some time in order to scan your EC2 instance. But if you go to the 
Mm, if you go to the findings over here, not in the findings, if you go to the dashboard over here, so after like two, three minutes, you will start getting like one instance that is not being scanned and all like that kind of summary, it will start showing to you. So like this. How many instance? One scan, not scanning. So it will first it will be in the not scanning stage, then it will automatically change into the scanning. Now if you click over here, so you can see over there there was actively monitoring. Let me go back from here. Let me go to the dashboard here instance. Now you can see over here actively monitoring. Now, if I go inside this, you can see it's the finding summary is there. And you can see these are the findings. Uh, medium is the Python, I think, the version, the package one. These are all the package vulnerabilities. It's the link to update. Now, if you click on this, any one of them, it will give you the detail about that CVE. So we can see the vulnerabilities categorized by critical, high, medium, and low not low, just critical high and medium. So these are the three uh, categorization being done. And even we can filter it by uh, findings by this uh, kind of resources, whether it's the EC2 instance, uh, we can have a container image, we can have it over here. can also have by lambda function and you can have also the all findings now if you go back to the instance over here you can click here and you can see there's two finding summaries so if you click on the high over here you can see a flaw was found so this is again a package vulnerability the finding details, then the score. So what kind of attack and also all the details are being clearly mentioned over here. You can just click back over here. So this is how Amazon Inspector works. It will auto, it will take time around five to 10 minutes. So it will start showing you, make it sure once you activate, and spin up your EC2 instance, and that's it, you will start getting over there. And make it sure in the account management, your account is being activated. And make it sure you have the EC2 scanning settings to the hybrid mode, and that's it. So you can see it will use agent-based scanning for all the eligible instances managed by SSM. Agentless scanning using EBS snapshots for eligible instances that are not managed by SSM. So that's the hybrid mode that we are having. So you can also utilize for the code repo and container image. You can try with the different scenarios. How does it works? And it's quite interesting. Once you have done, make it sure to you to deactivate and terminate your EC2 instance. In this scenario, we can also like integrate with the Amazon inspector with even bridge in order to send notifications to SNS or any email whenever any findings, any critical findings are being uh, detected. So we can get the alerts in real time. So I hope you got an idea. Do give a try to this, uh, to the Amazon inspector, AWS inspector. And do let me know in the comment section whether you were able to do it or you face some issues. I will definitely try to respond to you back. I hope you like this video. Thanks for watching.